All right guys, it's Bob here. And in this video, I'm going to bring you an unboxing and uh, look at this in action. Um, this has been sent out to me by a company called One by One. And it's actually been spelt, I don't know if you can see, hold on. Does it say it's in bigger writing somewhere? I'm not sure you can really see that. Yeah, it's the digit one and then buyone.com. So it's one by one. And this is a 5.1 amp, uh, three USB output. So, you know, basically charge three devices at once. I suppose what they do need to change is the fact that that says it's a dual USB car charger on there. And I believe they actually do a four as well. But anyway, enough waffling, let's get this uh, thing open and uh, have a closer look at it. I mean, packaging is extremely light. Um, which makes me think that it's probably going to be all plastic construction or something like that, which most of them are, and at the end of the day, where electricity is concerned, it doesn't matter how much the voltage is really, you want it to be. So, oh, actually, it's, that's much smaller than I was expecting. That's, sorry, guys, that just sort of shocked me a bit there. But uh, the top of it, I think, is aluminium. Yeah, it's aluminium, and it's got like a, a slight textured finish. Uh, it comes in many different colours. This one obviously red and the black body under there. And as you can see on there, we've got 2.1 amp, a 2 amp and a 1 amp. So, you know, you're talking iPhone, iPad, you know, uh, basically, you know, your, your Android phones, all, all that sort of stuff. So, yeah, I mean, I could sort of like charge my, my iPad, my iPhone and say a Bluetooth headset or something like that, you know. So, yeah. So let's take it to the car and uh, have a look at it guys. Okay guys, so here we are in the back of the car. Uh, probably going to be a little bit echoey um, and it's just easier than doing it in the front. So uh, excuse the uh, bits and pieces around on the carpet and that. It is a, a working vehicle, um, a hard working vehicle at that actually. So um, yeah, here's the uh, device that we're looking at. Uh, three ports on it. You do need to be aware in some cars of course um you know when you've got like it's like in the front of mine i've got uh, my sockets quite sort of recessed slightly so you know this is quite short this section here and this is quite broad and once it's in my front socket it's a little more awkward to get out you know to actually get your fingers around it and pull it out so you do need to be aware of things like that and especially seeing as how this comes in two port three port and four port as well i believe so you know if you're talking about a four port version then you know this obviously has got to get bigger again so anyway if we put that in my this one's uh, i need my ignition on for this one and the ignition is already on so you should i don't know if you can see that let me just see if i can just sort of zoom in a bit and right so here we are zoomed in you can just see that little blue light there and that tells you that the power is there so let me just come back out a little bit right so if we now uh, start plugging stuff in and uh, see what we can get so uh, if i plug that into the 2.1 in the top there and i'm going to plug that into my ipad air uh, so plug that in and that should start charging and yes there we go so that's the ipad charging and we'll plug another lightning lead in to the two amp underneath and we'll plug six plus in and there you go that's that charging <laughs> so whoop, that's two devices on charge and then if i plug in this little short micro USB lead into that one amp at the bottom there and I've got a little uh, earpiece here, a little uh, Bluetooth headset and if I plug that in there should be a little yeah and there, there you go, that little red LED's come on and that tells you that that is now charging so there you go, that's three devices all on charge there um, you know, I mean 
if you've got kids, you know, and you go out for days out, stuff like that, especially if you're on long drives, you know, this is a, a great thing to have in your car, really. Um, you know, you can keep them all quiet in the back and you'll probably hear a little bit less of the uh, are we there yet. Uh, I don't think it'll stop the I'm hungry and I need the toilet, but uh, it'll definitely stop the are we there yet. And of course, you know, when they've got things to do, it uh, helps stop the, uh, the stress and the fighting. So, yeah, I mean, you know, leave your comments underneath, you know, do you do it? I mean, obviously some cars now have USB ports in, but of course things are going to change in the future as we get uh, more sort of, as we change possibly to USB-C, you know, as cars also start to become more sort of uh, wireless charging and things like that, you know, as, as, you, as near field gets better. Uh, you know, th there is the option that uh, we're going to start charging things completely wirelessly, which is the way I see the future going. But uh, for now, these are definitely uh, a really good sort of addition to have. Um, so, yeah, like I say, leave your comments underneath, guys. Uh, tell me what you think. Uh, you know, they're cheap devices, well worth having. So that's it from me, guys. So that is the uh, one by one in-car charger and that one of course is a three port and it does come in two and a four all links will be left underneath and i'll see you all in the next video guys okay cheers see ya.